evening's function. And she is a person who has been honored probably more outside the country than here, because that includes being inducted into the International Hall of Fame for, by the Water Ski and Wakeboard Federation. And that took place in Santiago, Chile in November last year. A wonderful achievement. The De Villiers family is synonymous with water skiing in South Africa over many years. With Nadine and her brothers Andre and Zane having made a huge impact on the sport over many years. By the age of 17, Nadine already had won three, had set three girls' world barefoot water skiing records. And that was just an indication of what was to come. And she was trained in her career by her father, who unfortunately passed away, so cannot be here to share his daughter's time of being honored by her own fraternity. Nadine has boasted boasts no fewer than eight world barefoot skiing records covering slalom, tricks and jump, ten world barefoot championship gold medals, twelve Europe Africa championship gold medals, and a myriad of South African championships, titles and records. In a four-year period, she set eight world barefoot records, two in slalom, two in jump, and four in tricks. Her trick score of 4,400 propelled her into the Guinness Book of Records. Today, she still holds a Guinness World Slalom record of 17 crossings of the weight in 30 seconds, set in the Gauteng Water Ski Championships in January 2001. But I'm sure you what the, the real accolade was, was being honored internationally by being inducted into the World Hall of Fame. But she's also not one to rest on her laurels and, and take all, everything for herself. She has given a lot back. She has helped train many aspirant barefoot water skiers and she continues to serve the sport in which she achieved such great heights. She has served as president of the SA Water Ski Association, president of Gauteng North Barefoot Water Ski, as well as serving as an official judge and boat driver and coach at numerous ski schools in South Africa and Europe from 1997 to 2013. She's truly one of the greatest exponents in the world of water skiing. And there's a person who has followed her career since she said she was a girl of 15, and he, he's of course also entrenched in the, world of, in, the, in the world of aquatic sports. And he watched this amazing progress of this person who at the age of 15 was already making her name known. And um, he was telling me just now that when she had to ask employers for permission or to put in for leave to go overseas to Chile last year, they said, but what do you, what, what do you want to leave for? Where are you going? Why? And she was, she's so modest, she hadn't even told us, even some of her colleagues didn't know her achievement and where she was headed to an international hall of fame. And the person who's followed her career so avidly over all these years is tonight the one who's going to hand over her Lifetime Achievement Award, and that's Andre van Elsen. Andre.